boys. Welcome back to HHF. Today, we, uh, we got this trap right here. It's this trap right here from uh, Timu. And, well, we're gonna see if it works any better than the homemade trap we made in this video right here. And uh, if it doesn't pop up right here, it'll be at the end of the video. So, we're opening it and seeing what we have. A little update on the last video. We didn't catch a single green sunfish. Well, the last minnow trapping video. Oh, okay, so it just we didn't up. catch a single green sunfish. Cousin called us and said, hey, you didn't catch a single green sunfish? If we can figure out how to put a picture of a green sunfish on a screen, we will. If it never pops up, it's probably because, well, we didn't figure it out. Hey, that's pretty sweet right there, boys. So we got this spring thing. It's like a spring, and it's got these two little wire things right here. I guess the fish swim in here, and they can't figure out how to get out. That's at least how the homemade one worked. This one's a lot bigger, and it costs like five dollars or something. The price will be right here. So we'll see if it catches a fish. Now there's actually a ton of minnows right here. The spot we put the minnow trap in, the homemade minnow trap in, was right over there around the cedar tree. If y'all don't remember from the last video, I'll put a clip of it right here. Guys, it's the next day. I don't know how good you can see, but right out there is our tub. But yeah, we're just gonna throw this kind of right out there in that, between these two trees. And we hope it's good, so, yeah. By the way, we've got you leaned up on a chair and a pot because uh, we broke our tripod. Roll that instant replay of the memorial we had the other day. Yeah, roll the tripod memorial right now. Come. Tripod, phone holder. Was a good man. Sai, do you have any testimony? I was fishing, and I couldn't hold my phone and fish at the same time. The tripod phone holder he held it. Good testimony, Carson. Do you have any testimonies? One time, I was going to the bathroom and trying to watch him kill a gray, and the phone holder held my phone holder. Good testimony. Comment, uh, rest in peace, tripod. Yeah. Okay, now let's get this uh, minnow trap set. But first, we gotta figure out what we're gonna tie it to. I think we're just tied to this thing. Yep. So. Yeah, we'll just tie it to this little red thing and we'll catch y'all when we're throwing it out there. Oh, so, yeah, I, I almost forgot, guys. The bait we're gonna be using is dog food. So, yeah, now we'll see y'all when we get it set out there. Okay. Well, guys, we was gonna put some dog food in there. So, uh, yeah, explain the problem. Um, uh, it's too small. It just goes right through them holes. Like, dump it in here. Like, watch. It's all just, cut, like, g g going out. See, look. That's what happens when we try to pour it in there. So, yeah. We're going to have to go get some bread. We'll catch y'all guys when we get find some bait. Okay. We'll, we'll set y'all when we find some bait. Yeah. Okay, guys. We found a bait that fit in here. Where's my stick? Yeah, we got bread. Bread's really good bait, and it didn't fall out of the trap. That's the only downside I could think about. I'm putting it down for you. <laughs> the only downside I could think about this trap is it's pretty big holes, but, I mean, that's what we get for paying, like, five bucks for it off of Timu. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anywho, this is what y'all been waiting for, the store-bought versus homemade. Oh my my bet's on homemade, honestly. We got We got four minnows on the homemade one so i mean and we got two in the homemade ones on them just a milk jug we'll play that replay right here yeah that's yeah video. that looked exactly like the one look how fat he is he must have ate a lot of them yep he's been give him a eat now uh -oh. look we gotta release our animals properly Oops. nice and gentle yeah What else we got? Does he look like the ones we caught last week? Yep, same thing. So he's probably a bluegill. We got two minnows in a milk jug. Uh, we actually caught with graham crackers, too. This is going to be rough. I got a thorn bush sticking in my back. And I'm hanging over top of a pond. And you're complaining about it being rough. <laughs> I got that fence. Is it blurry? blurry? Okay, there it goes. It's only blurry now. Okay, so we're the string out now. You should just be able to pull it. 
Oh, the freaking gosh. Might have to eat this quite a ways, which means I'm going to need a lot more slack. I just pull it out of the mud. It's just cheap string anyway. Okay, you got a lot of slack now. I hope that's enough slack. <laughs> oh, we should have put it on the other side. We're amateur minnow trappers. But honestly, guys, there's a lot more minnows over here on this side of the tree. There's a ton. And there's a way better chance of catching a cat. Oh, my goodness. I don't know if y'all guys can see that, but. You see all the fish over there? Look at all the minnows right there. You, Yeah, y'all guys can, I think. I think y'all guys can see those. Comment down below if I'm wrong. I think y'all guys can see them. Look at all the minnows right there. Oh, better with the minnow trap. I didn't get it on camera. Oh, God, where'd it go? It's right there. I'm going to zoom back out to one here. There it is right there. I think I gotta give it a better yeet. No, uh, I think that'll be good, Zy. Okay. There it is right there. We're gonna come back tomorrow. It's a Sunday. So there'll be a verse, a Bible verse right before tomorrow. So if y'all see a Bible verse, y'all guys will know it's about we're about to come check these traps. So yeah, we'll see y'all guys after the Bible verse gets done playing. <laughs> Well guys, it's the next day. Hope y'all enjoyed the Bible verse. We're out here. We're about to pull in this minnow trap. Oh yeah, I've already seen them and they're flashing on. Comment down below how many you think we got. Cause y'all guys seen how many how many there was over here last night. It's kind of murky over here now. It's duck weeds. Oh my word. Oh my goodness, guys. Holy cow. Look how big those are. We got a ton of tadpoles. But we got two really big perch. The bluegills. Two or three pretty big size bluegill. And I, I knew we was going to catch a ton of tadpoles. Because this trap sunk. And yeah, we did, boys. The bad thing about this trap is there is really no way of, well, getting in there without reaching your hand in there. Yeah. I so we're going to have to reach in there and grab all these nasty tadpoles. That won't be too bad as a problem. Just grab the fish first. Got a fish right here. Okay, got a fish. That's a big, that's a pretty big one. Yeah, yeah. that's a pretty big one right there, guys. Come for this pond, that's pretty big. There's one fish. Bluegill. Two more tadpoles. And what do we got? A bunch. Got we got two. two. How many more fish we got? Just one. Just got a whole handful of them back in here. Man, we're going to have a lot of good frog hunting in this place, though. Yeah, but there's not any big fish in here to eat the tadpoles, because as you can tell, these tadpoles are huge. There's the other fish. He's an all, another big fish. Lay him out flat in your hand so they can see how big he is. What if I can get him out of here? Oh, there he goes. Wait, never mind. We got him. That's how big they are. That's pretty big for this pond because, like, the ones we was catching the other day was all pretty little. Well, this one, this one over here is going to get suffocated in there. Got to get him in the water. Overall, this Timu trap ain't too bad for five bucks. No. Actually, it's pretty good. Oh, there's a tiny one. Oh, there's another fish. Oh, yeah. Here's another fish. This is about the same size as we was catching last week. Three more tadpoles. We caught a crap ton of tadpoles. <laughs> There's there. another bluegill. That's about the same size we catched in last week too. Get that tree. Is that, is that all of them? Nope. Still a couple more tadpoles. Tadpoles are nasty looking. Ah. It'll be good frog hunting this year. Do a couple of them are passed away yeah, they riveted well guys we're gonna get the rest of these tadpoles out we'll catch y'all when we're over there setting it and boys we relocated the trap yep this is the same spot we put the homemade trap there's still a and book the, in it and we put the, that homemade trap and these homemade trap right here both in this location they both did pretty good so we're gonna put them back in there so far the store bought Timu trap has four fish and like 30 tadpoles. Yeah. Gonna rebait her, bait it here so we'll get a little bit of fresh bait. 
Maybe we'll catch catfish this time. It sinks, so. Oh, no, we haven't been catching no catfish, but our cousin Dallas come down with us and we caught us a catfish out of here. Man, this... We've been hoping to trap one in a minute trap, but it's not working. Did y'all see that over there? I don't know if I caught that or not. There was like 30. This little fish right there. Anyways, we're going to throw that over there. And we're going to do some fishing. Look at all the minnows, guys. I don't know if you can see them or not. Oh, what's that? It's my finger. Oopsie. Take it. Let me get over this way. Look, you see all the minnows right there? I put a circle around them. Pretty cool. You know we got featherhead minnows. No tadpoles like this. His bait is right out there. You can see his fishing line kind of right here. His bait's right out there. There's a ton of minnows out there. Can y'all see any of the minnows? I don't know if you can or not. There's a ton of minnows out there. Anything going after it? I think we need to walk around where we set that trap that first time so we can get those bigger fish. Well, guys, we've had the trap out here for probably two minutes, and we can already see a tadpole and a fish in there. So that's pretty good. We're going to come back and check it tomorrow morning, or somebody's going to come and check it tomorrow morning. Si has to go to work in the morning, so it might just be me in the morning. But we're going to actually, no, we're not going to check it in the morning. We're going to check it. This evening. We'll be we'll check it this evening and that'll probably be the end of this video. So we're gonna stay out here a long time and see if we can catch some fish. But yeah. We're gonna come check this this evening and I'm pretty sure it's gonna have a ton of fish. Because look, you can see all the fish out there behind it too. It's crazy. And so why don't you cast out there to see if you can catch something? We're gonna have a we're gonna have a bunch more tadpoles, guys. Oh yeah, we already have two of them in there. We have two in there. Hey guys, there's a bald eagle that just flew over them trees. If he comes back, we'll definitely get the camera out. It's pretty cool. You can hear that other bald eagle screaming over there. Guess them tadpoles are so stupid, they'll just go in anything. They're probably just swimming and went in there. We already have two tadpoles in that trap that we know of. Oh, there's a fish going for his bait. We'll catch y'all if we catch that fish or that bald eagle comes back. Oh, look, there he is, there he is. Yeah, there he is. There he is, guys. You can see him, you can see him kind of. Oh, I'm getting blurry. Run back out, run out, run out, hurry up. Oh, oh, I'm blurry, okay, there you go. Oh, better. Yeah, look at that, guys, bald eagle. Pretty neat. Hopefully we'll catch us a fish. Hopefully. Yeah, I'm changing locations. Where's your bread? Right there, there's his bread. There's too many tadpoles in here. Golly, there's a lot of tadpoles. Well, guys, it's the evening. We're about ready to wrap up the video. We're pulling in the minnow trap. Give her one last check before we end the video. We know we got a ton of minnows because we checked earlier. I meant tadpoles. Absolutely no minnows, though. I don't think we have any minnows, guys. Just tadpoles. So, uh, if we want to catch fish, we'll make a minnow trap. If we want to catch tadpoles, we'll use this one. Yeah, because this clearly catches tadpoles pretty good. Yeah. You know what? Why don't we get a tub and take these tadpoles up to the other pond? Okay, guys, we figured out what we're going to do. Got us a bucket. We're going to put some tadpoles in here. And take them to the other pond. Or, yeah, we're going to take them to the other pond. Because it doesn't have very many frogs in it. So we're going to take these to the other pond. We'll see y'all guys up there when we're to the other pond. If that makes any sense. Alrighty guys, we made it out here to the second pond. We're going to dump these tadpoles in here. They're all doing good, still in this bucket. Yep. 
One. Got one. Two. Three. Four. Save the last one. We'll put him right there and see what he does. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Howdy. Fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. Eighteen. Is that the last one? Huh? Yep, that was the last one. Man, I thought you just wanted to make sure you were but, Yeah, what was that, twenty-something? Yeah, no, eighteen. Eighteen, so... 18 dad bowls plus like the 30 something we caught this morning. Oh boys, there'll be a video coming out soon about us minnow trapping in this pond to see what kind of life lives here. Comment down in the comment section. What do you think lives in this pond? Because we're going to find out. What do you think we're going to catch? So yeah. Well boys, that'll be it for today. Yeah, uh... We caught four fish in the store-bought trap, like 90, 40, 50 tadpoles. And the homemade traps last week, we caught zero tadpoles and six, four fish in the tub trap. And six fish, or two fish, I mean, in the jug trap. So that's six to two, but we did catch a crap ton of tadpoles. So we're going to count them. We're going to go ahead and say the Timu Minter Trap one, just because it was $5 from Timu, which is like, cheap place so we're gonna go ahead and say the, the team of trap one uh if you want to see more cool videos from us there'll be two of them right here and there'll also be two more at the end of the video so thanks for watching we'll see you next time like and subscribe too. don't forget to like and subscribe what do they have to do to see more awesome videos hit, hit the subscribe, subscribe.